Now dear students, we have taken question number 5. Let us read the question. In a class test in mathematics and English, it was found that 55 students have passed in mathematics, 46 have passed in English and 35 have passed in both the subjects. If the number of students who appeared in the test is 100, then find number 1 the percentage of unsuccessful students in both the subjects, number 2 the percentage of students who have passed in mathematics only, number 3 the percentage of students who have passed in English only. Now let us write what are the things given to us. So dear students you can observe that here n of m that is number of students who passed in mathematics is equal to 55 n of e that is number of students who passed in english equal to 46 and n of m intersection e is equal to 35 but it is it is the set of students who have passed in both the subjects that is in mathematics and in English. Dear yes, students, now here we have to find the number one, the percentage of unsuccessful students in both the subjects. Before attempting, what we'll do? Let us find n of m and e. It means it means the number of students who pass at least in one of the subjects. This equal to n of m plus n of e minus n of m intersection e this is just the basic formula we learned this is 55 plus this is 46 this is 35 so this is 101 minus 35 if we subtract we are getting 6 this is 6 okay now question is we have to find the percentage of unsuccessful student in both the subjects that is number of unsuccessful isn't it m dash intersection e dash since it is both given that's why we took this intersection okay amar yaar percentage will have a eta kotha ki yaar total number of students appeared ki man 100 so it will be very easy for us to find the percentage to i mean to kenoka likhe bar with ya n of m intersection e tar complement so complement hole kenoka suppose n a dash can you call equal me n of u minus n of a so same liquid me n of u minus n of m e take us a n of your value came on a cell 100 or it will allow me came on also 66 you didn't subtract guru 34 the percentage of unsuccessful student in both the service given over 34 percent so let us write down is equal to how much 34 percent take us a that is the number two to law so dear student now we have to find the percent of students who have passed in mathematics only that means n of m minus e that is they have passed only in mathematics not in english so let us represent this in the Venn diagram. This is set M. This is set E. Okay. We have to find M minus E. This part. Now, dear student, this part how can we represent? From the whole set, that is N of M. From the whole set, we have to remove this part, isn't it? What is this? This is this part is the intersection part. N of m intersection e now let us put the values n of m was given 55 very simple sum you see and its value is 35 so it is 20 okay so percentage of student will be 20 percent okay therefore e is equal to 20 percent okay now let us take number three students in number three it is asked the percentage of students who have passed in English only. I am here. I am set draw. That means by the help of Venn diagram will do. This is set M. That is for the mathematics, and this is for English. Amar ki N of 
e minus m only they have passed in english okay tar mane ei bostu tu ei part tu lao lage ei part tu kene golam okay gote e set er pora e set er pora amar ei bostu tu bad din okay we have to subtract it now what is this this is the intersection part of this two set intersection ami kene ka represent karu m intersection e ami te ki karu the value ke ta put karu this is 46 is equal to 11